Hello. In this lecture, we are going to register a domain name in Route 53 for our website. To register our domain name, select Services, then come down to Networking and Content Delivery, and select Route 53. On the Route 53 dashboard, we are going to check whether our domain name is available here. I've checked Jupiter.com and that domain name is not available. So I'm going to just use jupiterlabs.com. So once I type my domain name in here, I'm going to click check. And that domain name is available and it has been added to my shopping cart. I'm going to click next to continue. On this page, you are going to enter your registration information. And once you've entered those information, click continue. On this page, verify your information and accept the terms and click complete order. It is going to bring you to this page and it is going to say your order was submitted successfully. I'm just going to click close. On this page, it is saying domain registration might take up to three days, but from when I've registered for a domain name in the past, it takes about 15 minutes. So we are just going to click go to domains and it is saying my domain registration is in progress. I'm going to give it some time to complete the domain registration. So after waiting about 15 minutes, my domain name is finally registered and I can go to the dashboard. And in here, I now have two domain name registered. But if this is your first time, you only see one. I can click on the domains and you can see both of the domain names that I have registered. And this is the jupiterlabs.com that I just registered. This is how you register a domain name in Route 53. In our next lecture, we are going to be pointing this domain name to the DNS name of our application load balancer. Thank you and I'll see you in the next lecture. Bye.